We've all been there. Tired, moody, unable to focus. Sleep is vital. Chronic sleep problems can have serious health consequences, including lower life expectancy. But a new study suggests some people don't need as much sleep as others. Researchers found people who slept less than six hours a night and reported no daytime drowsiness had larger brain volumes. They're saying that if you sleep very little and you're not sleepy during the day and you don't have insomnia symptoms, you might have a bigger brain than, than usual. Sounds like a good thing, but the study also found short sleepers had slightly lower scores on tests of general cognitive function. So we asked experts, what's the takeaway? I think it just tells us that we need to study this more. Don't judge your sleep based on some measure of what the perfect or ideal sleep should be. Everyone's different. And yet, more people are judging their sleep, tracking it, rating it. Many wonder if they're getting enough. And studies aren't always clear-cut. For a long time, doctors advised against napping. But advice is shifting slightly. A recent study suggests a modest association between habitual daytime napping and larger total brain volume, but found no relationship between naps and improved memory. I think that's uh, interesting, but there's a lot of holes that the, the authors acknowledged in the study. A big hole in many sleep studies is that participants are asked to remember when, how long, and how well they've slept, which isn't easy. Experts insist sleep medicine is still a relatively new field, and the best advice remains simple. For the vast majority of us, it's probably better to try to aim for at least at seven or eight hours of sleep at night uh, for the sake of our brain function. Phones down, lights out. Don't overthink it. Christine Birak, CBC News, Toronto.